Welcome to the Ultralight Airplane Workshop. My name is Leon. The primary purpose of the Ultralight Workshop channel is to document the process of designing, constructing, and test flying a brand new Ultralight Airplane. In fact, I expect there will be a number of brand new Ultralight Airplane designs that we will build and test fly. In addition to the new Ultralight, we also will have restoration projects on a Quicksilver MX and Weed Hopper. And to supplement construction videos, we have a Hummel Ultra Cruiser that is in the process of being built and we'll document the uh, remainder of the build on that airplane. During the design process, we are going to document the nitty gritty details of designing a new ultralight airplane. Starting with requirements and goals for the airplane, we'll proceed into analytical design, uh, the geometry of the airplane. We will go into spreadsheets to help us get a little faster through some of the analytical equations. Uh, we'll use a number of sources for those analytical equations. We'll go over what those sources are and evaluate them. And then we will also do a little bit of computational fluid dynamics. That'll be fun. For reasons that I'll cover in a video on requirements and goals for the airplane, I'm considering using carbon fiber, but aluminum is an alternative. And I'd like to do some tests comparing carbon fiber and aluminum. And so we're going to do some comparative tests. I'll try various methods of laying up the carbon fiber, wet layup, vacuum infusion, vacuum bagging. And I will also try to compare directly carbon fiber to aluminum as far as thickness, weight, strength, shear goes. Well, I had a lot of fun destroying some carbon fiber. And speaking of destruction, when we start getting into the construction phase of the project, we'll do some destructive load testing there. We'll start with sub-assemblies, small pieces, individual pieces, and test them until they fail to see how well they matched what we expected from the analytical part of our design. And if we have enough funding when we get to the larger assemblies and full assembly, we will do some destructive testing there. We'll at least do static load testing, but possibly go all the way to popping and tearing. Once we have a fully assembled airplane, it'll be time to start flight testing. We'll go through a rigorous flight test program, starting from simple bunny hops and high-speed taxiing, all the way up to a stall and spin testing. But we'll do it in incremental steps, being very careful the whole way. Once we've got through the construction part of the first airplane, we'll have learned a lot of things, and when we get in flight testing, we'll learn a lot of things. And I'm sure it'll be time to design a Mark II version of the airplane. So we'll go through it again, uh, go through the design revisions, build, and flight test another version of the airplane. And following that, I'm sure we'll come up with new airplane designs that we want to build. It'll be fun. So I hope you enjoy the channel.